Dan. Hey, what? Are you ready? For what? It's DIY day! Yes! Now that we have an office, we are gonna make it over. It's gonna look so good. I've got the plans, I've got the paint. It's gonna be so fun. Are you excited? I am. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. Hey, Brian. Hey, what? It's a beautiful day. Don't you know? It's a beautiful day. This is The Thread. You ready for this? I am so excited about this project because I love to decorate. I am ready to DIY. I love DIY. I had all their albums in the 80s. <laughs> Rock and roll. Finally have a space and now we gotta do it up. Maybe we gotta decorate it up. It's decorating time. And we okay. have an expert here. Yeah. This is Joey. Not me. No. This is Joey. <laughs> All right, Joey, so this is our space. Right. This is where our editor is. So okay. we're constantly in production mode. Sure. We're able to sit right here and help put the show together. Okay. This is Virginia's favorite piece de resistance there, a, a whiteboard for her to throw all kinds of ideas. Okay. There. Yeah, we kept it clean for you. But sure, it looks nice. Workspace. Okay, gotta have it. Meeting space. Mm -hmm. I've come up with kind of a, a design plan that I think might help you guys a little bit. And so I was thinking that maybe in this corner over here you could DIY like a couple floating shelves. Of course you guys want to have your logo, you know, the whole reason why you're here. And so I thought that to keep it a little bit more modern to maybe make this a dark gray or a black and then make the arch gold or silver and put that right above here. I like oversized wall art, especially in spaces where you want to feel inspired. Lastly, I think it would be really important to kind of tie it all together as a really nice geometric rug, simple rug to put under this table. I've got one other need. Sure. So I have a thinking chair. Okay, yes. Yeah, that I need to put, it's, okay, it's actually a sit and spin. I love it. Uh, so I, once you move this table, you're gonna have all the room in the world. Right in here? Spin, it's pretty mobile. I mean, it's not, yes. I mean, I can move it wherever I need heavy. to think. This is my favorite part in okay. the whole thing. If you're ready to do this, I think that you should paint the back wall white and then do a Sharpie accent wall to kind of mimic wallpaper. I am excited about Joey's ideas. She always gives one big challenge though, and that is gonna be that wall. How fun is that wall gonna be? I mean, I used to draw on the walls as a kid and got in trouble for it, now I'm getting permission. But it'll look like a thread. It'll, yes. I like that. Yes. So it'll How be, long will it take? Uh, you know, maybe four hours to draw, four hours to, to trace. I'm kinda nervous about the time that it's gonna take to do that back wall. You've got all the time in the right, world, right? We got all the time, it's really, yeah. If I'm completely honest, I'm a little nervous about working with Tim. I mean, I know that's not a shocker, but I don't know if he can paint. I don't know if he can hang shelves. I certainly don't know if he can draw. When I was in preschool, I got sent in the corner for drawing outside the lines. <laughs> I got in trouble for coloring. But I always have backup. Tim, we gotta go, we gotta yeah, go. Yeah. And why are you changing clothes? I like to change wardrobes several times a day, like Cher. Okay, well we have a lot to do. I know, like there's no way we're gonna get this done in time. How are we gonna get all of these things done? We have no time to get it done. How are we gonna do this? Stop worrying, I have secret weapons. Secret weapons, what are you doing? Hey babe, you called? You need some help with something? Hey! Hey, hey Jason! Thanks for coming by. Yeah, yeah. Small favor. Okay. Just We'll touch up in the office. Sure. Yeah. It's really fun. Gonna be a fun project. Won't take long at all. Yeah. Thanks, Jason. We are bound to find something here. This is Restore Decor Edwardsville. Be prepared to be amazed. I am prepared. Hi, I'm Virginia, and this is Tim. Hi, Hi nice Dana. to meet you. Good to meet you. We heard that you have some amazing stuff here and you're doing amazing things with it. Can you give us your story? Thank you so much. We do have amazing things and we have an amazing story, at least we think so. So people from our community donate things that they're done with, that they were going to put outside for big trash or get rid of in some other way. So instead they bring them to us. And we're all volunteers. We've got a few people here working today um, and they transform and give new life to these things. Um, and we sell them in our shops on Saturday, and all of our proceeds go back into our local community. God placed this idea on my heart, and he's really just opened the doors for it to be able to happen. 
that brings us all together. And in this day and age, that's exactly what we need. It's absolutely so rewarding to see a piece come in like some of these that you see over here that really was just ready for the trash. And then we have volunteers like Mark um, that literally give them new life, replace a leg, replace part of the whole piece, transform it into something completely new, and then giving new life to people that maybe need help with medical bills or need help to fund children's programs or other programs in our community makes it all worthwhile. Well, I know you're only open on Saturdays, so it's Saturday. Can we go shopping? Absolutely. Let's go. Let's do it. So welcome to Restore Decor. Oh, you're okay. I think I spy something. I see something. Are we looking at the same thing? <laughs> Right here? That's the one. Yes. How cool is that place? I mean, they spend so much time just upcycling furniture, knowing that they're giving back. Such a creative idea. Those folks, they just get it. I mean, the fact that they're sharing their passion in a way that's helping others, so cool. And the piece that we got, you have no idea how perfect that is for our office. <laughs> Ready to meet some more secret weapons? I am ready. Here they are. Mary and Hello. Sandy, Janet, meet Tim. Good to meet you. Good to meet you. Thanks for having us. And thank you for saving us. You are so yes. welcome. There's no way Our we could have pleasure. done that in that amount of time, or really just done that at all. Yeah, we kind of got sidetracked. So yeah. tell us a little about what you do, because you know Tim has never been here. Oh, Tim, this is the best day of your life, right? So <laughs> yes. we are vintage home decor. We have a little old, a little new, some mixed in between. But basically, we give old things new life and try to help you fit it into your home and the style that you've created with your belongings. So that's that's what we're all about. And you teach people how to do it too. We do, we do. We carry some great paint, and we have customers coming all the time that ask, "How do I do this? What can I do to this?" And so we'll walk you through the process. We also have classes. Um, so if you want a girl's night out or a guy's night out, you, know, you can come in and, and we'll create something together and just share what we know. There are no secrets here, so if you have a question, we try to answer. And the best part is you get to tell them what the project is. Which is so cool. Because they're right? so good, they do everything. And you try to accommodate everybody, yes. <laughs> and I got to believe that when a group is working on a project like that together, really brings them closer together. Oh, it's so much fun. We enjoy it. We just are thrilled every time someone comes in and we can, you know, help them create something meaningful. You're not just selling furniture, you're building community. Absolutely. How does that feel? Amazing. It's probably one of the most rewarding things that we get to do is when somebody comes in and they want to paint something in their home and they're scared or they're afraid and they don't think they're going to mess it up and we walk them through the process here, um, and they go home, and they come back with their pictures, and they're like, look what I did, and they're searching through their phone to find what they did, and they're just, they can't believe that they actually did it, and did it successfully. You, you ready know? to see them? I am so ready to see them. Me too. All right, here we go. Yes. That is perfect. It's so perfect. Yes. Oh, 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 yes. I love it. You know I love that. I know you, you do. Know so I love your heart's doing a little happy yeah, dance right now. Big happy dance yes, right now. And it big. will every time you I'm see dancing it. right now. <laughs> I'm, I'm that, I, I, I better Thank I'm you. stop that dance. But right here. Yeah, love it. Those ladies love what they do. And more than that, they love sharing what they do with others and teaching them how to do it. And the piece they made for us, very personal for me. And I think it's going to be the perfect piece for our room. The Thread, brought to you by Bomberito Automotive Group. This is Frank Bomarito. You'll get a bigger selection and better value when you visit any Bomarito location. State-of-the-art showrooms and the most advanced service centers. Bomarito has over 8,000 new and 2,000 pre-owned vehicles, all with Missouri's best pricing, greatest financing, and lease options for everyone. Nobody has more. Nobody sells more. Your next car is at Bomarito or Bomarito.com. We're in every neighborhood. We want to thank you guys for stopping by today, and we hope that you will come and see us every Saturday. Yeah, it means so much that you spend this time with us, and we hope that we are able to give you a taste of the joy in living and the joy in giving of yourself to others, because that's what this show is all about. And hopefully someone inspired you to go out and help other people, or maybe you just felt connected because you got to hear their story of struggle, and you can relate to it. Yeah, so if you have a story you'd like to share with us, we want to hear it, and share it with the rest of those who are getting in on the fun. Thread up, y'all.
My husband and I don't think of Securus like a firm. We really think of it as more like a family. Our friends at Securus really care about the people they serve. My favorite thing is they made it clear and simple to plan our retirement. Not only do we feel prepared, we feel protected, and that is all because of Securus and the Circle of Advisors. It's so easy, we only have to come to one place for our tax advice, insurance, legal needs, and investments. Securus Circle of Advisors, helping people build and secure their vision of retirement. I don't know any other place like it. I just know I like it. This week's Thread Up story is brought to you by Securus Circle of Advisors. Hey, Virginia. Do you think we're really physically ready for DIY? What do you mean? I mean, do you think we're in shape to do this? Hey! <phone rings> Lori, what's going on? How are you? Great to You're see great. you. Great to see you too. Great to see you, Virginia. Hi. We're in the middle of this DIY project, and I'm just wondering if we're in shape to do this. You got a workout for us that could help? You know I have a workout for you, Tim. I always have a workout for you guys. Oh, it's way more than that. Point and look, and then point and look. So you're getting a little shoulder work too. I want you to pick it up, and I want you to look at it, uh -huh. and shake your head, close your mouth. Yeah. Like this, mm. you just do this. Because Virginia, you're gonna share with him what he needs to do around the office, and that is the most important exercise is to go up and down so that that's what you okay. can say. With your mouth with, closed. Yeah, <laughs> with your mouth closed. There you go. There. There and there. Now there. My most favorite exercise that I think is gonna benefit Tim for the rest of his life is this one. <laughs> Over here. This is ridiculous! I get Back to there. Mm -hmm. Over there. I have a board for the Thread Office on Pinterest. It has everything we need. So first of all, I found the shelf where she was talking about we're gonna have a vanity area in the corner. I even found how we can make frames to go around that big <sighs> on clearance. Is that not amazing? Plus a whole tutorial. <sighs> mm. So gonna do this. And I even have laid out <sighs> and get that green pop of color. This way. Mm. Mm. I smell something. Tim, what the hell? What are you doing here? Well, I, I've got a southern nose and I smelled something and I smell biscuits. That's what I smell. What are you doing here, big brothers, big sisters with biscuits? You came to the right spot because what we're doing, opening a biscuit bar. What? Yes, just a pop up though. It's only for this weekend only. How did you get involved with this? Well, we are so lucky to be partnering with Big Brothers Big Sisters in this wonderful space. And I, this came to me and I just had to do it. It's really all about relationships. And where do you build relationships? And everyone across the world builds them around the table. We just decided, well, why don't we just build the table? So this is what we did. We built this table in this test kitchen and on our roof. And we want to bring everyone together at the table to get to know each other, care about each other. And hopefully a lot of people will say, you know what, we need to do that for the kids too. Yeah, we're going to keep popping up two or three times a month and something different all the time. And, and, and with something different, uh, different people will come and we'll just have a good time. Why biscuits? Well, it's my great-grandmother Geneva's recipe. So, you know, it's in my southern roots, and I just wanted to share the biscuit love. Uh, well, <laughs> I got some love for biscuits, so if you share your biscuit love with me, we're all good. This biscuit real good. Mm, that's a good biscuit right that's there. That's a good biscuit. Mm. To have a successful life, you need love, hope, and opportunity. The only thing you get love, hope, and opportunity from is another person. Oh, Kelly, this is so cool. I'm just, I'm just gonna take a biscuit for Virginia and, and one for her friend Tim. I think he, he'd probably like one. He'd probably like one. <laughs> I know See you, well. Tim.
Hey, see you. I'll see you, kids. Bye. Enjoy the biscuits. Biscuit love. <laughs> I know I will. Really? Really, we have one morning to put our entire office together and Tim just wanders off, just leaves me hanging all by myself. I got biscuits! <laughs> just grab them in the biscuits! <laughs> See what I did there? It's time to sit a spell in the hot seat. Brought to you by Rothman Furniture. Oh, uh, you know what time it is. It is time for the hot seat by Rothman Furniture, and that is one hot seat, TK. Upgrade the look of your home with this classic button tufted barrel chair. This chair is covered in stylish, durable bonded leather. Designed with comfort in mind, it features Pirelli style web seating that gives you an even, consistent seating, meaning this chair is as comfortable as it is stylish. Available now at Rothman Furniture. All right, we've got Andrea and friends in the hot seat. We've had biscuits and nothing but goes better with biscuits in a game show. Are y'all ready? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, here we go. Our subject is tools. This is our DIY show. We're talking tools. You ready? Yes. All right, here comes your first question. You hammer a nail with this tool. Hammer. Hammer, yes. Hammer. If your hammer's name was Jack, it would be a what? Hammer. Jack Hammer, that's exactly right. When sawing a piece of wood, you may use this tool. A, a saw. A saw. If you wanted to brush paint onto something, you may want to use this. Paintbrush. Yes. If you wanted to wrench something, what tool would you use? A wrench. Yes, and the box that you keep tools in is called a? Toolbox. Toolbox, yes, indeed. <laughs> Andrea, wow. Congratulations, you win a whole basket of biscuits. <laughs> From the Biscuit Bar here at Big Brothers and Big Sisters. You'll want to check it out this weekend. Thanks for joining us on the hot seat by Rothman Furniture. I love my wife. I love my baby. I love my biscuits. Tim! in gravy. Uh, what are you doing? Hey, Virginia. I've been looking everywhere for you. I've been at Big Brothers and Big Sisters. They got a biscuit bar there. Biscuits? Kelly, yeah, biscuits and a cat head biscuit. I've been putting our room together and you've been eating biscuits. Yeah, I've been really? eating. Really? I get two biscuits. I'm two fisting. Okay, let's go. We got work to do. Do you put honey on it? All right, Virginia, this is the place I was telling you okay. about. A new nature. They make amazing things and have an amazing mission to boot. Cool. Hey, Robert. Hey, what's up, Tim? How you doing, man? That's my friend, Virginia. Hey, Virginia, Hi. nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, I wanted her to meet you and hear about the amazing things you guys are doing here. So Great. just kind of tell us your mission with Anu. Sure, so Anu Nature is a furniture company, and we teach a felon's training programs to help guys get back in the workforce. So our goal is to kind of like give guys a really broad spectrum of skills so they can get back in the job market quickly. How did the idea come about for you? I, I was volunteering with Mission St. Louis just for like eight hours a week and met a couple guys going through the program after my second class and just really connected with the heart of the mission and really wanted to just make it my full-time job. So we started refinishing furniture three years ago and then to hire guys we started building furniture. So now we custom design and build furniture for restaurants and residents all over St. Louis. Really connected with one guy named Guy, actually, was his name, and he hadn't worked in like five years. And most people complain about going to work, and this guy just wanted a job. He had three felonies, and he was 43, didn't have a job, couldn't get one. So, um, I don't know, I, just, I love work, and I couldn't imagine not being able to do it. Before I got involved with this program, I had a bad run-in with authorities, and, you know, some bad decisions that was made. To me, it means my best possible effort at like leveling the playing field. Like I never got turned down for a job and I had maybe 10 before I was a stonemason. I always wanted to work with my hands and like building and things of that nature. It was just always my like desire. Like I can wake up every day and be like I don't mind getting up and go ahead, go build. Get my hands build, dirty build a little bit. Things, smell the woody pine in there type of thing. Yeah. Yes. That old hurt type of thing. You know? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. All right, Robert, so taking just this one piece, what are the skill sets that have gone into making this? That's really why we chose furniture, is just I can teach welding, I can teach painting, I can teach wood prep, I can teach arborism, all on one little tiny piece of furniture. It's a lot of skills in one stool. Yeah, it's such a small piece, and there's so many different things you can get your hands into immediately. I love that. It's beautiful. The stool's got a story. <laughs> Lots of stories. Absolutely. I don't know if it's like an overwhelming, like, 
you know, warm, snuggly feeling or anything like that. It just seems like the right thing to do. And I don't mean to say that in the way that's like, oh, everyone should do this and, you know, I'm so great for doing it. I just think it's, it, I've built my business around it because it's possible. Buy one, get one half off. Another amazing offer from Rothman. Incredible. Buy one, get one half off savings at Rothman. Buy this sofa for $5.99, get this dining set half off, just $2.25. Reclining sectional, just $19.98. Get this bedroom set half off, just $1,000. Mix and match items store-wide. The possibilities are endless. Buy one, get one half off. Or four years, zero interest with no money down. Buy one, get one half off. There's always something new at Rothman Furniture and Mattress. Hi Kevin, my name is Tim. We heard you were in need of a new roof. Masters General Contracting and Restoration would love to help you with that. We'll put a new roof on your home at no cost to you. I just don't like to see people suffer and cancer is such an awful disease. It's unbelievable. We do roofing, siding, gutters, windows, doors, painting, interior, exterior, historic restorations. Attention to detail and 100% customer guaranteed satisfaction. I mean, that's just awesome. I can't wait to meet the guys from Masters. Just take it personally. Eckerd's Family Farm is a proud sponsor of The Thread. From DIY pick your own to homestyle meals made for you, there's nothing quite like farm fresh family fun. If you're in the mood for a mile wide country smile, it's high time you and your crew head over to Eckerd's. Spotlight on Noodles and Company and their Bearing Kids in Mind event. Teaming up with Children's Miracle Network to spread some fuzzy love at Cardinal Glennon Hospital. And The Thread was invited to join in the fun. So our mission today is to give those kiddos that need a little hug, a little something extra, a nice fuzzy teddy bear named Oodles. It's really soft. And we met some amazing families. What's up, Miles? This was his 39th or 40th surgery I've lost count. This is Caleb, he just had surgery. I just think it's really awesome that they do this for these kids. So I try and put myself in the position of being seven years old and this being my life or any of the age that these children are at. And these things like this make their stay better. We are all about family, and we are especially interested in charitable organizations that do things for kids. It's not too late for you to get in on the fun. You can make a donation to Children's Miracle Network at your local Noodles & Company now through June. Thank you. Hey, Threadheads, we want to hear from you. That's right. This is your show, and we want you to be able to have a voice in it. So if you'll send us a message, any question you have for us, any comment, any story idea, we'd love to hear it. All you have to do is go to our Facebook page, The Thread STL, and hit message. So what, St. Louis? Brought to you by Endeavor Capital Mortgage. Tell us something fun. How do you like to get crafty? I'm constantly crafty with photos. I actually have them all over my house. I do gallery walls. I sew. I sew clothes. I sew clothes. Come on. It's a show and tell. I have a feeling. So the, the bar top is Tiger Wood out of Brazil. You did this? Everything. It's an old taxidermy boar's head. You know the rubber hand holding the gasket? That's awesome. Look at that. It's sweet. It's starting to look pretty good. I think it's, I think it's working. Jeff, have you seen my hammer? Thank you. Bring her in. Star of the room right here. I uh, yeah. All right, are you ready to see the room? It's the moment we've all been waiting for. It's the big reveal. Yes. Here we go. Ready? Dun, dun, dun. So remember, Joey wanted us to have our logo on the wall to inspire us as we work. Yes. So that's what we got from 4Q, Timeless Vintage. Beautiful. That. That's the sign we found at Restore Decor. We knew we needed it as soon as we saw it. And our Tranquility Corner. Oh, love this. So I said I needed a vanity area. And Tim needed a place to do his hair. So we did the floating shelf that Joey suggested with the mirror, and we did the plant to bring life into the room. And she said to tie it all together, we needed a rug. Voila, it's the one she even showed us. And finally, the wall. Everybody yes. wondered how the wall would come out. Here it is. Yes, there it is. Look at it. It looks really good. And I'm I love impressed. the sign. I love the sign because that is something you say all the time. Love the next person who crosses your path. 
and it's something that you got from your dad. And we needed something very personal in here that would encourage us every day. There it is. We can look at that and be inspired. Yes. There you go. But you forgot one thing. Oh, my thinking chair. Yes. <laughs> Not brought... just one thinking chair. No, I brought you one too. Oh, thank you. Uh -huh. We can think together. Yeah, we can think together. Okay. Yep. Perfect. It's time now for the end. Brought to you by Midwest Hemorrhoid Treatment Center. All right, I know I gave Virginia some grief in the beginning, but once we got into the project, it was really fun, and I gotta say, she had a plan, she stuck with it, and it looks really good. I mean, the only thing missing is a, a biscuit bar. <laughs> Can't go wrong with biscuits, I'm just saying. I love our space, it is perfect. Thank you, Joey, for all the great ideas. And I have to say, I am really impressed with Tim Ezel. He was such a help, and he drew every one of those lines. And they are perfect. And yes, he actually hung every single thing exactly where I showed him. And here's the thing, I think I got him hooked. I mean, there's some other places in there that could be fixed up. So we've got some fun projects coming our way. I can't wait to share them with them. Spot Media Production Group.